What's up, boys and girls? Me again, Jimmy the Fish, aka Opus XP. I'm bringing you another video or another gadget. And this one is the nice one the Hawksbarna hatchet. Awesome little hatchet. I love it. Yeah. Well, this is a nice hatchet because it has the right weight to it. Very comfortable handle. You know, very nice look to it. Nice sheath. I mean, this is an awesome little hatchet. Um, and the other thing that I liked about it because I actually asked for certain things on it when I was I bought it off the eBay and um, I actually contacted the seller before he shipped it out and asked him to check a few things before he shipped it out uh, one thing was the the wood grain on the handle the sheath the grind and the edge and the centering here on top so you can see there pretty damn centered the grain is pretty decent and the sheath has very little wiggle to it you cannot you can't take it out you can't you can't take it out it's just, it's just a fit very nice uh, tight fit to it and you got the grind and the edge on it, it has an awesome edge on it I'm not, I'm not gonna touch it. I'm not gonna do nothing to it. It's perfect the way it is. Um, the sheath, a simple sheath. I need to treat it, um, but the 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 uh, actual fit on it is excellent because I've heard stories that you know the uh, out of all the husbarna, the hatch has the the worst sheath of all. And actually, this one, in my case. The hatch has the best sheath of all the other two. All the other, you know, all the three I have, the, the, the hatch has the best sheath on it. So that's pretty cool. Uh, of course, you know, for being a hatchet, is not that inexpensive because this runs on the high 30s, low 40s uh, price range. But it's an excellent hatchet. It has the very, I want to say, this is, the, this is my preferred weight on a hatchet. You know, it's still light, but. It has some heft to it, some 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 weight to it. So when you use it, you know you'll get some some more power behind the swing. Um, I really really like it a lot. I like all my husbarnas. Very nice uh, tools. Um, I guess all the other hatches that I get, I got and stuff like that. You know, if you if. If I was to pick, I would just pick the Husqvarna ones. That's all I need, you know, the, the hatchet, the carpenters, and the the multi-purpose forester. With those three, I wouldn't be more than happy. You know, I don't I don't need anything else. Everything else, I was just to try it out and stuff like that. But if I could only pick, you know, out of different ones, that those three would be, you know, my preferred ones because it is good quality. It might not be finished, you know, it's pretty as other brands, but for the money, it's a very, very good product. Um, and I don't think you can go wrong with this. Um, as far as, uh, as far as, uh, you know, the uh, durability of it, the uh, the actual, you know, uh, materials, the quality of the materials they're using and stuff like that, it's pretty, pretty awesome uh, hatchet and, you know the accents and everything they're pretty awesome so I'm very very satisfied with the cost barna um, and I do think is one of the better brands out there you can buy and they won't break the bank so <clears throat> if you're looking to buy something new you know um, that is good quality and you know will be like you know crazy expensive uh, this brand cost barna is I think your best bet uh, and if you like this this look, you know this very rustic look, you know like I do. So, yeah, this uh, this is the look I like when I think of an axe or hatchet. This is what I want it to look like. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you soon again. Um, I'm gonna be making videos uh, later on uh, on the week or next week maybe I don't know uh, regarding my workbench and also the restoration of my cruiser axe also. So um, stick around. Um, just be patient because it's going to take me a while. But um, 
so far uh, this is what I got oh and also another axe is coming it's a Helco Germany axe and I'll, I'll show it to you when I once I get it well thank you for watching and I'll see you soon again bye bye